Welcome back. We have exclusive new developments in the controversy surrounding a Mecklenburg County judge who allegedly shoved a delivery driver in the courthouse parking garage. Our chief political correspondent Emma Withrow joins us now to explain what comes next. So Judge Kimberly Best is currently being investigated by the Judicial Standards Commission for that delivery truck driver incident that happened this past July. So for some quick background, Best, who was appointed by Governor Roy Cooper and is currently running for re-election, is accused of phys physically shoving a delivery driver trying to get into the courthouse parking garage. Tried to drive around the delivery truck, which had, been, which had been partially blocking the entrance. She scraped the side of her white Porsche SUV, got out of her car, and then the altercation between her and the driver, Megan Gunter, began. Now, after a complaint was filed with the Judicial Standards Commission, they've launched an investigation and has started setting up interviews with people who actually witnessed the event that day at the parking garage. Judge Richard Boner, who served on the Mecklenburg County bench for almost 30 years and on the Judicial Standards Commission for six years, isn't really surprised Best is being investigated. I would say more often than not, most of the complaints when I was on the commission uh, were dismissed without any further proceedings. So this is somewhat of a rare occurrence that mm -hmm. they're taking on and actually pursuing an investigation. Yeah. So coming up next really is what, what's going to happen is that investigator who's looking into this, he's going to conduct interviews, he's going to file a report, and if the commission thinks that there's, you know, substantiated evidence that this actually happened, they would then decide to schedule a hearing with Judge Bess, they would listen to her perspective, and then they'd go back into a room, they'd deliberate, and if they think that these allegations are true, they, and the majority of the commission agrees with that, they could either censure her or take her off the bench completely. Are, so. you, are you surprised by any of this? Well, when I heard about the incident initially, um, I was surprised, but it's interesting to see how now this board in Raleigh is taking this into consideration. So it was also interesting, Judge Boner said that out of all of these complaints that the Judicial Standards Commission gets, mm -hmm. they only actually pursue investigations into about 10% of them. So this investigation that's actually happening is a rarity, is what he had to say. So we'll have to see what happens. But he also said it's probably not going to be concluded by the election in November, so we'll have to wait. Always going to be after the election. I know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, Thanks, Emma, guys. thank you so much for that.